So mosquitoes are really public enemy number one, especially here in Florida, especially this time of year, uh, because they seek us out and uh, we are their prey. Uh, but what if your computer could battle mosquitoes and stop the diseases that they carry, some of which can be deadly, we know that. Mm -hmm. It's already happening in Tampa. AI is now being used to help stop mosquitoes and spread the disease. And tonight, Fox 13's Lloyd Sauer shows us why a local scientist is using AI as part of her personal story of survival. We know that parents can inspire their kids. But Farhat got her inspiration when a mosquito that carried a disease bit them and made them deathly sick. They watched some of their neighbors die. What people are going through in that time, because you then have, like, in the children are also being sick. The ch children are also being dying. But years later now, she believes she's found a way to figuratively bite back using AI to fight mosquitoes. Power of AI is unlimited. Whatever you can, want to do, you need to have a vision with the AI. The fan is working, so the mosquitoes go in. Her vision is a mosquito trap that takes pictures of the trapped mosquitoes, and in an instant, AI identifies the kind of mosquitoes they are, looking for the specific breeds known to carry the deadly diseases that could have killed her parents, who are fine now. They are very proud of me. Yeah, they know, they know all about it. Farhat just earned her doctorate at USF, not in bug science, computer science. She believes AI can help stop outbreaks of malaria and dengue that can be deadly for people who are old or in compromised health. If you are not taking um, uh, the medications properly, you will die. The mosquitoes will fall here. Her beta version AI traps are out and working around Tampa, catching mosquitoes and taking their pictures. AI can then alert officials if specific breeds known to spread disease are lured into the trap. And then that area can be sprayed because mosquito-borne disease can spread for miles in just a day. Yeah, we can stop spreading the malaria. That's the thing. Listen, she and all of us are excited about what AI might be able to do, but few of us are inspired the way she is. Her parents are fine now, and they're watching from Bangladesh. They are like doing some praying on me so that, yeah, they can one day, they can see my trap. She's found a way to bite back those deadly mosquitoes, part of her personal story, and now her passion to stop mosquitoes using AI. In Tampa, Lloyd Sowers, Fox 13 News. Her research is funded in part with a grant from the National Institutes of Health. She chose USF because of the research that was already underway on the campus here in Tampa.